So Gary, great to see you again. Um, and we're here to talk about one of the hottest topics around at the moment, artificial intelligence and its role in the communications industry. So can you just give us a, an overview of Amdocs' vision for AI and the role it's going to play? We're excited about AI. The industry is. Everybody's um, looking at how to embrace it. And I think that if you look at the vision that you know is is really around the corner is that 85 percent of the customer interactions or customer conversations are actually going to be between um, between consumers and, and a machine. Now they won't all be AI driven. AI will be at the heart of a lot of the efficiencies and effectiveness, and quite frankly, the customer satisfaction uh, drivers of the industry. And I think it's going to be uh, super exciting. Um, now, Amdocs launched its AIA product at MWC 2017. Right. Um, there are, are already sort of uh, AI-based tools out in the industry. So what's, what's unique, what's different about AIA? There is enormous investment going into these machine learning tools, uh, engines. What we want to do is we want to bring and embed intelligence into the business. And so we're taking these engines and we are making them work in the call center and the you know in the retail experience. We're we're we're, we're making an impact the the network and how the network flexes and is, is is designed and built, and we're tuning those engines for that industry. The neat thing about AI, one of the most powerful you know, technologies of AI is around something called journey analytics, and AI can see these patterns. They can see other journeys that similar. Uh, that consumers went on that were similar and then it can make recommendations that are going to be most successful or, or provide the best consumer experience. These types of starting points make a lot of sense. Okay. Uh, how do you see this playing out in terms of bots maybe replacing humans uh, and, and what kind of impact might this have on the industry? Right. Sure, machines can do things that are fairly um, well documented, that are well defined, uh, and people are looking at strategic size of the business, how to impact uh, the growth of the business. The same thing is, is, is going to take place in the communication and the media industry in terms of using humans at the right place to uh, engage and then using machines to, um, to also um, help, help, help define how those engagements can be more effective. What kind of role do you see um uh, or how, how you see big data and analytic, analytics developing in the c communication space and, and, and what kind of capabilities does Amdocs have to bring to that market? Right. The difference is, is data is going to move away from being batch, fairly low volume, to huge volumes of data that are running in real time. Because if it's not in real time, you're not in the customer journey as it happens. You're not in the network as it, as it falters. You need to be in the moment and moving, moving towards real time AI is where the real differentiator is. I don't think the trick is about data in a given system. It's data that's between systems or between departments where you can see that, hey, you know, somebody's connected car experience or, or connected home experience can lead to an upsell or a cross-sale of a, of a media package or these types of things between departments. And this is, this is a really interesting part of the science. Right, okay. Yeah. But there's probably only a few operators currently that can see how this is going to happen. What can Amdocs do to, to help CSPs understand how AI will impact their business? Uh, you know, the main thing to do is to get started, really. And um, we've taken some concrete steps to try to help media and communication companies get started. We've already embedded intelligence into 50 op more than 50 operational business processes, whether it's for the marketing, you know, how, how to promote, how to effectively cross-sell um, for the advertising space, how to promote the right advertising in the right place at the right time, um, or the care channels. So th these are some of the places where we've focused on trying to bring value with short-term use cases that can, can drive impact and allow carriers to get started, to build this culture of change and to crystallize it and spread it throughout the business. So, I mean, it's clear that AI is going to play a, a really critical role in a lot of strategic developments in 2017. So it'd be great to catch up again this time next year and see how things have developed. Yeah, I look forward to that. Gary, thanks, thanks very much. Thanks. Cheers.